All right, welcome back to my channel, everyone. What I'm gonna be doing today is hooking up a cell phone booster. Now, the area that I live in, I maybe get one, sometimes two bars outside normally on my cell phone. If you live in an area like that, where inside the building you get almost no reception or, or none at all, especially in a metal building, even if you get good reception outside, but if you're in a metal building, you almost cannot get any reception. In fact, with the one or two bars I get outside here, in this storage building that I have here, I get zero, nothing. So, that's gonna change today. <laughs> um, I purchased a uh, cell phone booster. Let me show you what it consists of and how we're gonna hook it up. All right, so with the cell phone booster, you're gonna get the repeater, which amplifies your signal. And that's it right there. You got your out, outdoor antenna and your indoor antenna connects here. You're gonna get an indoor antenna. You're gonna get 50 feet of cable here uh, from your outdoor antenna to the amplifier here. Then you're gonna get, I'm pretty sure this is 15 or 16 feet of uh, cable from your booster here uh, to your indoor antenna. You're gonna get the outdoor antenna. That's it right there. You're gonna get mounting bracket for the outdoor antenna also. You're gonna get an indoor bracket for the indoor antenna, this little loop here connects to this here. That's for that. I'm gonna get a power cord here for your booster and of course your instructions. All right, so the first thing we have to do is connect the outdoor antenna and I'm gonna show you the mount that I purchased for that also. So I just purchased this ladder stabilizer here. This thing is awesome. This is made by uh, Werner. This stabilizes the ladder at the top where you're working. Um, so you have no fear of the ladder moving around on you and twisting and all that stuff. So this is perfect. Very easy, there's some pins here. You take on and off, these come off here. And uh, there's one pin on here to stabilize, to keep it from coming out basically. Um, and there's a locking mechanism here, but it just slips on. You put this pin in on the bottom and you're done. Let me show you how to install it. So all we do, this hooks up to the last step or whatever step you needed at basically, but usually the, the top or the second step. Um, so what we're gonna do, Just like that. Okay, so on the back side, you got this pin right here, and you slip it through this hole. Just like that. And now we're in. And now we're ready to use it. That stabilizes the ladder so you don't have to worry about it twisting on you or doing anything weird. This is super easy to take off. Let me show you how to do that too. So to take it off, it's very simple. That pin we just put in, just pull that out. This here, just push this down. And you're off, that simple. So this is the mount that I purchased here. It's all metal and it's chrome plated. Now I'm going to put a link in the description as always to everything that I'm using here. It should, you should find it right in the description. How I'm going to mount this is this is going to go on the side of the building right here 
And on the inside of the building, I'm going to put this board and sandwich the building wall, basically, in between this. Um, it comes with some lag bolts for if, you do, if you're going into concrete, or these very coarse thread wood bolts, basically, is what they are, um, which is going to be going into this 2x4 like this, and, of course, into the mount here. Now, I can't show you me doing it because I can't hold one, the camera and do it all one-handed. I'm not that good. <laughs> so, you get the idea. I'll show you the after results. All right, so I connected the antenna up there. And this is what it looks like up close. You see I bolted it to the building. And it is clamped at the top here. And I also siliconed where the wire comes in so we don't get any water or bugs getting in there. Also, the arrow on the antenna has to be facing up when you mount it. All right, so you have to remember when you're putting up your antenna, you have to know where your cell tower is. Mine is, uh, I think it's like two miles away. And I went on Google map, I seen where it's at and I've seen where the house is at and I've seen what angle I need to put the antenna at com you know uh, compared to the building at what angle I have to put it at so it has to point directly towards that tower cell tower to get the best reception you can get so you can see mine here it's angled slightly maybe maybe 10 degrees I don't know if that uh, towards the tower in, in respect to the building. So now what we have to do, I have to work on the inside, the uh, amplifier inside or the repeater. Um, I have to get that connected to the antenna. And uh, then I have to put the indoor antenna in. So we're gonna do that next. All right, so we're inside now. This is the inside antenna and this is the uh, mounting plate. So normally it would hook up to the back here like this and it would hang on the wall and it would send the reception out or the, the cell reception out that way. But what I'm gonna do, I mean, I could mount this up here and get all this part of the room here, but I'm gonna mount it on the very, very top where the I-beam is and angle this down, almost not quite straight down, but probably like this so it gets because behind this wall, I got my storage rooms in there too. I want to be able to get a signal in there also. So I'm going to angle these, angle this down, maybe on a, I don't know, 10, 20 degrees, something like this. So it gets this part of the room and the storage room. Because the uh, signal doesn't go straight out. It's, I don't know what degree angle it is, but it's more like this, you know. So... Uh, that's how we're going to hook it up. But I'm not going to be using this. I'm going to have to kind of rig it up so to stay that way. And we'll probably have to use wire. <laughs> all right, I have it all hooked up. And this cable here, if you follow it, it goes all the way to the outdoor antenna. So here it says outdoor here. Here is the indoor antenna. And of course, your power which I have it conveniently located right here. Okay. I connected the uh, indoor antenna on a slight angle, as you can see, so it goes into my room here, and I'll show you in a second what I mean. Easy connection here, and it goes right to here. So it's basically in, out, and your power, and that's all there is. Then on the top here, you're going to have, it's going to go through its sequence to figure out which is the best uh, reception it gets. I have LTE out here mostly and T-Mobile, or AT&T and T-Mobile out here. Um, so it looks like the LTE is coming in pretty good. Okay, so also, just as an added safety, I heard uh, some comments I was reading about some of these boosters. These things get pretty hot. Okay, I don't know how hot, but just for safety's sake, I put it on top of a piece of hardy board, which is that, that concrete cement board. So in the event it were to heat up, you know, I wouldn't have to worry about nothing. It's sitting on top of this piece of hardy board here, 
and I don't have to worry about it. All right, guys, so there's the antenna. I took a snapshot on my phone here before I plugged everything in, and I was getting zero reception, nothing, no bars at all. And this is what it looks like now. I get five bars. This is fantastic. <laughs> I can be in here now, not miss any calls. Um, I don't have to worry about that anymore. I'm going to put a link in the description under the video to the booster, the mount, and even that ladder um, uh, stabilizer. So you guys can check those out. Um, that is about it, guys. Um, this is this is going to change everything for me because every time I'm in here, I, I'm, I'm thinking, oh, is somebody trying to call me? Or if there's an appointment and somebody's going to call me at a certain time and I got to step out of the building and it's, it was just a pain. Now I don't have to worry about it anymore. Okay, guys, now for the ultimate test, I'm going to call my wife. She's inside. It's ringing. Now, the question is, will she pick up? Your call has been forwarded to an automatic voice message system. Okay, she didn't pick up, but it works. Everything works. We're getting a signal, and that's awesome. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you guys in the next video.